she considers the First Amendment to the United States Constitution the number one challenge she faces in fighting against disinformation. So here she is explaining that. The number one challenge here that we we see and is, of course, the First Amendment in the United States pro, is a fairly robust of um, course, yeah. right, uh, protection of rights. And and that is a protection of rights, both for platforms, which I actually think is very important that platforms uh-huh. have those rights to be able to regulate what kind of content they want on their sites. Uh-huh. But it also means that it, it is a little bit tricky to really address some of the real challenges of where does bad information come from and sort of the influence peddlers who have made a real market economy around it. Okay. So that's her position on that. She seems a little bit dismayed or put off that the First Amendment to the Constitution is rather robust in protecting the rights of citizens. She acts as though she's trying to find the bad information And the influence peddlers, may I suggest, may I suggest, Ms. Marr, that you begin by looking in the mirror. May I suggest that you um, listen to the editor, the editor who says that uh, NPR is leaning to the left. May, May we suggest that? The guy that just... Um, that just resigned. In fact, here it is. Looking at an article here in the Daily Wire, NPR editor who accused network of liberal bias resigns. Senior business editor Yuri Berliner is resigning from National Public Radio, NPR, a little more than a week after he publicly accused the network of espousing left-wing bias in an essay. In a post to X, formerly known as Twitter, on Wednesday, Berliner shared what he said was his resignation letter to NBR CEO, that's right, Catherine Marr, who lashed out at the editor's critique and has faced blowback over old tweets. I am resigning from NPR, a great American institution where I have worked for 25 years, Berliner said. I don't support calls to defund NPR. By the way, I do support funds to or excuse me, calls to defund NPR. I respect, he says, the integrity of my colleagues and wish. Now, how can you how can you respect the integrity of your colleagues when you said that your network is espousing left wing bias? How can you do that, Mr. Berliner? But nonetheless, that's what he does.